number one is make sure you get you plant good quality seed okay insist on a germination test from the supplier and make sure it's good quality two inoculate that seed must be inoculated you will not get nitrogen fixation without it because the rhizobia that uh, that nodulate soya beans are not native to our soils. That's number three, plant into moisture. Do not plant dry, plant into moisture. You'll get your crop up then. Uh, you'll need certainly pre-emergent herbicide sprays. You should put them on. There are a range of those that you can use, but that's essential. You'll get your crop up. Uh, then it depends on what you're growing it for then. If you're growing it for seed, you're going to have to water it. Uh, in most areas, it'll depend on, again on the wet season. Some years you won't have to, others, others you will. Um, then the next very important thing for a seed crop is insect control. Absolutely essential and that will, be, that will start to raise its head from flowering onwards basically. Up until flowering you're likely to get some leaf chewing insects and so forth. They're not going to cause you much problem. But from flowering onward Towards the pod sucking bugs in particular are a major problem and you know you may be looking at two and three sprays of insecticide to, to clean them up. Outside of that uh, they are relatively easy crop to grow. Once they're out of the ground they're, they're a little bit finicky at getting them out of the ground. Once they're out of the ground they're, they're very good and they'll grow very well and they don't require a lot of management until you come through to that insect phase. Obviously you water them and so forth if you need to.